Good evening for many. The second half of region play began Thursday night in high school girls basketball. And we'll start in region six where Harbor Creek played host to McDowell. And right off the opening tip, the Huskies getting on the board first. Brooke Presbilski cashes in on the layup. Trojans would answer on their first trip down the floor. Jessica Hetz comes off the screen there, pulls up, knocks down the short jumper. She finished with a team high 14 points. Back the other way we go. The Huskies work the ball around, and eventually it's Presbilski calling bank, able to knock it down. She poured in a game high 17 points for McDowell. A nice feed inside to Nelson as she gets the easy bucket to fall. She would finish with six points. However, it's Harbor Creek taking this one in overtime, the final 44 to 39. Doug Chusey's Villa Maria Victors on the road at General McLean this evening. Second quarter, Victors up by seven. McKenna alone skips it across to Carissa Dunham for three. Defense leading to offense for the Victors now. Tori Mays with the steal, and she's going to go all the way in for the easy two in transition. Villa would go inside the next time down the floor as Lena Walls finds Jaden McBride. She had nine points on the night. Late in the half, General McLean's Brooklyn Bowen hits a three-pointer from the corner, catch and shoot, able to knock it home. Later for the Lancers, as they were scrambling, McBride hits Dunham, who connects on another triple. Dunham with 12 points, Walls with 15, and Beal with 12 as Ville Maria goes on to win this one, 61 to 18. Pat Miller's Gerard Yellow Jackets against Josh Ponsel and Fort LaBeouf in Waterford. Second quarter, Jackets up seven. Bison get on the board. And it's the corner three-pointer from Allie Young as she had eight points. More from LaBeouf. Emily Samluck finds Jillian Soder for three. She had 14 points to lead the Bison. Gerard answering back. Lily Polk fires a pass to Kayla Sharman and the St. Vincent recruit takes the rest of the way in for two. And then the baseline out of bounds play. Sharman finds a cutting and finishing Peyton Kalicki for two of her nine points. And finally, it's Sharman with another drive and finish. She had 13 points. Polk led them with 17. Gerard edge, edges Fort LaBeouf 40 to 39. 